मैडम वाइस चेयरमैन आई एम एक्सट्रीमली सॉरी दैट लास्ट टाइम वेन दिस बिल वॉज डिस्कस्ड अनफॉर्चुनेटली आई वॉज नॉट हेयर हाउ एवर आई हैव गॉन थ्रो द स्पीच इज विच ऑनरेबल मेम्बर्स हैड मेड ऑन दैट डे including the intervention of the minister the home minister's intervention was highly disappointing now madam i wish to deal with some of the points that have been made in the course of the speeches on my bill many of them agreed that all the regional languages should find their proper place in the proceedings of both houses though some of them thought that the proper present arrangement was quite good i am not saying that the present arrangement is bad what i was demanding was that there should be proper arrangements for speeches being made in all the languages not only those enumerated or listed in the 8th schedule but members should be able to make speeches also in their mother tongue even if they are not included in the 8th schedule there need be no apprehension that i am interested in ruling out the mother tongue which is not included in the 8th schedule i certainly stand for mother tongue being permitted to be spoken here but at the same time i thought that in order at least to make the present arrangement better he should provide for <coughs> translation in the language which are listen in english schedule our friend of the opposition have taken exception to my suggestion sanskrit is not a modern language which people speak 
This is a language in which we do not go to fight election or ask for vote or transact our day to day work in our daily life. I think the other language that are mentioned in the eighth schedule should be taken up more seriously. Languages of our state should not be left out. This is all that I suggested. Some members thought that I was denigrating Hindi. Those who are aware of the proceeding of the house over the past two decades or so know very well that I have always stood for Hindi being given its proper place as a link language in our country.